Hello and welcome to the section 4 of the course Suspicious Network Traffic Hunting. Now in this section we are going to take a look at various points. We are going to learn about various network traffic analysis tools and how we can hunt for suspicious network traffic. So let's start with the first video of section 4 ARP Analysis. In this video we are going to take a look at couple of points. We are going to learn about the basics of ARP and how we can analyze ARP packets. So let's talk about first of all ARP. So ARP is address resolution protocol and what is the work of ARP in the first point you can see it provides MAC address of the machine in network. If you have IP address of a machine and if you want to get the MAC address you can use ARP packets to get information about the MAC addresses. Attacker can also take help of these packets. So you can see in the figure that attacker is sending ARP packets in the network to get information about the MAC addresses. Now how we can generate ARP packets and then how we can analyze it that I'm going to show you inside Kali Linux. So open your Kali Linux operating system. So guys uh, I'm inside my Kali Linux operating system and now we are here to analyze ARP packets. So first of all we need to generate ARP packets. How we can generate? For example attacker can uh, scan the entire network and can generate ARP packets. So we have tool available in Kali Linux. Let's use them. So what you can do here, you can click on applications, you can select information gathering and there is a tool available NetDiscover. So with the help of NetDiscover, we are going to get information about the IP addresses, MAC addresses, the vendors etc about the machines inside the network. So you can click here and open it. So this is basically NetDiscover and uh, you can see these options are available here. You can provide a complete range, you can provide the interface where you are working and it will provide you information about the machines and it will generate ARP packets. So how we can uh, capture ARP packets? We have a tool in Kali Linux. The tool name is Wireshark and with the help of Wireshark we are going to capture these packets. So let's open Wireshark inside Kali Linux. So click on applications, select in sniffing and spoofing and click on Wireshark. So here we have Wireshark open and we are working on ETS0. Great. So what you can do here First of all, you can start capturing. So you can double click on ETS0 or your interface and double click here. Now you can minimize it and uh, you can type here netdiscover i interface and your interface basically ETS0. And you can hit enter. So now it is trying to send packets in the network, ARP packets, and Wireshark is there. So Wireshark is going to capture these packets inside it. Now let me go back to the Wireshark and here you can see that Wireshark is capturing all these ARP packets inside it. Now we have enough packets so let me stop the capturing so click on red button and we have stopped capturing here right so these all are ARP packets available here. Now let's talk about ARP so ARP is address resolution protocol so it provides you the MAC address of the particular IP address right. For example if I select this packet so you can see here in the source, source is your Kali Linux operating system. Destination, basically there's no destination, it is broadcasting in the network with the help of ARP protocol and this is the length and this is the information. So it is asking that who has this IP address. If it is available in network, please tell to this IP address. So this is the IP address and this is the IP address we are looking for. So for example this one, so it is asking that if network has 192.168.0.3, if yes, please tell to 192.168.0.67. Alright, so you can also double click here. You can see address resolution protocol. You can get information about the IP address and MAC address of sender. You can see here. Like you can see the sender MAC address, sender IP address, target MAC address, which is broadcast, and target IP address. Alright, so this is how you can analyze ARP packets inside Wireshark. So it means that someone is actually scanning our network and someone is trying to get the MAC address. You can see here that this is a complete pattern of ARP, right? And this is an indication that uh, someone is trying to scan our network. Got it? So uh, now you know the source, then this can help you to find out the machine which is generating this traffic. So that's how you can analyze address resolution protocol in Wireshark.